got him. He went splat. Hey guys, and welcome back to Call of the Wild. Today's video includes the highlights from one of the craziest hunts that I have ever been on in Silver Ridge Peaks. It's crazy what I managed to find today, guys. You're not gonna believe it. And for today's hunt, we are hunting with the Rhino. It is such an overpowered weapon and is so much fun to use. So today, we are pretty much gonna be hunting exclusively with the Rhino. Now I'm trying to get really comfortable with taking long range shots with the Rhino. It only zeroes up to 75 meters. So you do have to do a little bit of practicing to take these long range shots. And this shot was a pretty far one for the Rhino. So that was a 172 meter shot. Ooh, we were very lucky there. That was a neck shot. That was a neck shot, but that did the trick. And that was a vital shot. And this is a black. Almost thought he was melanistic for a second, but that would be a very sweet trophy. And unfortunately he is not. If you do enjoy the video guys, make sure to hit that like button. And if you'd like to join us for more daily Call of the Wild content, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to click the notify bell and we're gonna head right into it. Now let me know in the comments, guys, what you would like to see in upcoming videos. Any ideas that you have, anything you'd like me to cover, please let me know. I would love to hear from you. Look at that, guys. Level five Rocky Mountain Elk. And he doesn't know we're here. All right, I have the rhino on me and I'd love to get him with the rhino. We're up here in Bear Wallow Basin. actually pretty close to him. Okay, so this is to 75. All right, we're gonna go for it. Here we go. Should be good. He's down to 50. Yes. No, no good. And we do have two vital blood splatters. Where is he? Here's hoping he is gonna make it. They like to troll. Everything likes to troll lately. And what a great spot to land, but not really. <laughs> Terrible. Okay, buddy, you can do it, right? You can do it. Here we go. Yes! He is a diamond. He is sweet. And that was a left lung liver shot with the Rhino 454 from 89.31 meters. And isn't he a beast? And look at the wonky rack on this guy. That is amazing. Love his right side. Usually diamonds are pretty symmetrical, but this guy is definitely not. So he is 474.73 kilograms. 495.7, 41.4 is diamond, so he makes it by quite a bit. Just over 14 points. And that is pretty amazing. That is awesome. Let's taxi that. And let's take a photo. Yes! And this is where we found him. Bear Wallow Basin right at the top. That is amazing. Now, just a moment ago, guys, we did spot a legendary level nine mountain lion. <laughs> we actually spotted him on the other side of the lake and I had a terrible wind. So I actually fast traveled back to the outpost and I'm coming around the other side now. And now we can see him perfectly. Now all he has to do is make it and we have to make a good shot. That would help. All right, let's try it from here. All right, a little nervous here. I'm gonna aim a wee bit high. We got him, we got him. And he is down, sweet. All right, you can do it, my friend. But can he? All right, how you feeling? Not super good, I know. I'm, I'm sorry, but not really. Okay, here we go. Yes! He just makes it. 39.1 and 39 is diamond. He is a very tiny diamond, but he is a diamond nonetheless. And look at that shot. I aimed fairly high 
So there was quite a drop on that shot. If I had a dropped any lower, I would have messed that up. But that was a double lung stomach shot from 115.73 meters with the Rhino. And that is pretty awesome. That's two diamonds today. <laughs> that is pretty, pretty crazy. And this is where we found him. Tabagooch is an awesome, awesome lake. I have shot so many amazing trophies off of this lake that I actually dropped a tent here. I know the outpost isn't too far, but I do like having a tent there. Holy pronghorn! Oh my goodness! I had no idea there were this many pronghorn here. I haven't been here in a while. No big boys in there! Level five. Are you kidding? Uh, yes. Okay. That is uh, crazy. That's awesome. All right. Let's see if we can't take them with the rhino. My wind isn't awesome, but it will be all right, I think. I'm going to get as close as I can. He looks like a big one. I think he's starts his, his estimate starts at 96 and 98 is diamond and the problem here is there is no collar for them and I'm not even going to be able to see them in here. I don't think I can take them with the rhino. Ugh. Um, I don't have anything else on me because I have tents on me. I don't have any other weapon either. I have the 300 on me. That's it. They're gone. They should be gone, but I don't know. They're gone. All right, well, we're gonna have to put a tent on this side and then I guess we're gonna change the time. Okay, we dropped a tent here and we made it just after 8.30. This zone is from 8 until 10.30. And hopefully we have a much better vantage point and we do have a good wind right now. Now the question is, will I be able to get eyes on them? One thing about Silver Ridge Peaks, there's lots of this stuff, and it is it is very easy for them to hide in there, and they're not here yet. I can see. But we do have an awesome... Oh! I do stand corrected. There he is. Yes. Okay. Perfect. 96 to 111. He can still be a troll. He definitely can still be a troll. I don't know. He doesn't look huge. He really doesn't look huge, huge, huge. I mean, he looks beautiful, but I don't know if... I don't know if he's a diamond or not. I really don't know. Let's get to 100 meters. Alright, we're gonna take it from here. Here we go. Perfect. Oh, dropped him. And another one. Better leave that. I want to keep this zone. That's what I love about the Rhino. It goes from class four all the way up to class nine. So you can shoot so many things with this really overpowered handgun. It is just so much fun to use. And there he is. There he is. Can't really see him too well. All right, here we go. He's a diamond, 101.9. Yes, that is amazing. That's our third diamond today. What a crazy day. This does not happen very often, guys. That was a double lung, liver and stomach shot. Look at the, look at the insane penetration. So that was 102.99 meter shot with the Rhino. And he is a 101.9 and 98 is diamond. So he is a good 3.9, almost four points above diamond. That is pretty sweet. 63.72 kilograms. This is like one of the best hunts I've ever had on Silver Ridge Peaks. It really is. And we are not done. We're going to keep going. All right, let's pick up those other ones. It would be nice to find a really nice rare. Oh, that one was thoracic. So that is... Oh, it was a good shot. We did get left lung as well. And neck. Neck's a good shot. 
106 meter shot. And this one, look at the crazy, because of the crazy penetration, we managed to get intestine, stomach, liver, and left lung, and that was a 108 meter shot. It just seems like such an overpowered handgun, such an overpowered weapon to be using on the pronghorn, but you do get integrity, so it's a lot of fun to use the rhino in Silver Ridge Peaks, it really is. And this is where we found them. The Bending Forest. All right, let's see if we can't find a monstrous mountain goat. They are actually not a common diamond for me. I struggle with them. A little bit. I have not shot a diamond mountain goat in months. Months, oh! Oh. Well, it's not a five, but that is a big mountain goat. And I think 107 is diamond for them. So this guy definitely has a shot at making it, and I have a terrible wind. Terrible! All right, well, I'm gonna try. I don't know how close he'll let me get to him, and I don't know if I'll even be able to see him. Yeah, I should be able to. He's not in the grass. If this scores diamond, this will be our fourth diamond today. Like, what? What? So we're in Swiss Valley. And this is by the Bighorn Sheep Outpost. Well, these guys don't seem to be any wiser. If I get eyes on them, I take the shot from here. There he is. He's alert. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna reload. Okay, he's alert and he is attentive. Here we go. No, no! No, don't do that. Okay, here we go. We got him! We did get him. Yes! And we do have vital blood, so we are in very good shape. Question is, what is he gonna score? He certainly has a really beautiful set of horns on him. Well, here we go. He's a diamond! Oh, that's crazy! <laughs> that's amazing! I can't even believe that! 1077, level 4 diamond. Let me taxi that. That's nuts! Okay, let's look at this shot. Absolutely beautiful. So there is not a lot of drop. That was a 122 meter shot. I aimed right about, right at the spine. I believe is where I aimed, and that was the drop. Zero to 75, and that was 122 meter shot, so. So this guy is a common, and he, oh! Diamond's 107.6, I was thinking it was just 107. It makes diamond by 0.1. That is pretty lucky. Right long. From 122.28 meters with the rhino. That's amazing. <laughs> That is so insane. Well, this is where we found this beast. Swiss Valley. Now seriously, I have to show you my codex. Diamond Mountain Goat. Diamond Pronghorn. Diamond Mountain Lion. And a Diamond Rocky Mountain Elk. 1900, 21, 19. All in an hour and 20 minutes. That's crazy. It's so crazy. I mean, I did hunt for about an hour and a half before I found the first one, so I, in all honesty, I have been hunting for about three hours on this map. And that is what I found. And there are many, many days where I hunt for hours and I find absolutely nothing. Just some days, some days you get really lucky, and that is today. It sure doesn't happen too much. Okay, guys, so we are here in the lodge. And we have four diamonds that we are putting in here today. I wish that white outline would get fixed. I don't love that. But here is our diamond mountain goat. He made it by 0.1. He was a level four. And that was crazy. What a crazy hunt. I'm, I'm speechless. And this is probably my favorite find for today. And the very first diamond that we found. And that is our 
Rocky Mountain Elk. They are not easy diamonds. As you can see, this is actually a troll and I have one other diamond in here. I do have a few on Xbox, but that's it for PC. So that's a really, really cool find for me. 495.7. So this guys is my Silver Ridge Peaks combined with Savannah Lodge. And this is our pronghorn from today. This is my little pronghorn corner. Looks like I have five diamond pronghorn now and then a couple of rares, but that is, that is the big man from today, 101.9. And we have one more. And the last diamond from today's hunt is our mountain lion. Mountain lions are not difficult diamonds, <laughs> but I was very happy to find it nonetheless. So so that is going to wrap up our video for today, guys. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, I'm going to ask you to smash that like button. And if you'd like to join us for more daily Call of the Wild content, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to click the notify bell. And we will see you guys in the next one. I challenge you guys to head out to Silver Ridge Peaks and find one diamond. You can do it. Send me a photo to my Discord. Would love to see it, guys. Take care.